Hello honeys, welcome to the vlog. It is time for another tub talk. These have literally turned into my favorite videos because it's so much fun like making them. So you may have noticed I added <sighs> incense. Your girl has uh, been into incense lately. So that is the smoke that you may see, but it just puts me in such a good mood. So, it's pretty toasty in here, honestly. I made the water pretty hot. So, before we get started with today's video, I am happy to announce that we will be doing another Honey's Collection drop, so stay tuned to hear more. And if you haven't already, be sure to head to the website and grab my calendar, because it's freaking tight. That is all. For today's video, I figured that I would do dating tips for my ladies out there. Okay, the smoke is getting like really intense in my face right now. So, like I said, today's video will be dating tips for my ladies out there. Um, mostly because I feel like dating now is like an official sport. You have matches, players, strategy, competition, balls, goals, pros, amateurs, penalties, scoring, spectators, losers, game time decision, leagues, alternates, physical effort, protective gear, and if you win the championship, ladies, you get a ring. So, that being said, if you are watching this, I hope you drink some wine real soon and meet a boy with a huge D who texts you and buys you food. But in the meantime, let's get started with this tub talk. As I'm like slipping backwards, you know, doing videos in bathtubs is actually a lot harder than you may think. Now, I feel like sometimes I hear women be like, I don't need no man, which you don't. You know, men ain't shit, blah, blah, blah. Okay, first of all, let's, let's be real. At the end of the day, everyone wants to find love and wants to find someone to settle down and spend the rest of their life with and have kids and do awesome life things or whatever it is that you want to do. So I get it, but I see right through you. And all of this like, uh, all men are dogs, men suck, blah, blah, blah. Shh. Love is real. Wait for it. Okay. I don't believe all that shit because there are men out there who will make an effort to make you smile. They'll support your dreams, encourage the positives in your life. They'll write you love notes and sweet text messages and enjoy you beyond the bedroom. They'll want to know if you've eaten. They'll feed your body when it's in need or feed your mind if that's what you crave. There are men who will love you like you have never been loved before and it won't be watered down by just physical attraction. It's rare, but so are you. Love is out there, just wait for it. Believe in it, wait for it. So just a, just a couple tips, a couple tidbits. Also this flips up, fun fact, in case you wanna like read a book or something here while you're in the bath, which is pretty cool. All right, so I am 100% sweating. I really wonder if you can see this on camera right now. Made the bath too hot. Okay, I'm fine, it's fine, we're fine. Oh gosh. Whew. All right, couple dating tips, tricks. I don't know, whatever you really wanna call them. I'm not really sure. First and foremost, I mean, ladies, you, you, you deserve to be shown off like a hospital bracelet on Snapchat, okay? Let's not get past that, you deserve that. Real men make your panties wet, not your eyes. You can't put a crown on a clown and expect a king. Doesn't work that way. And honestly, I will never understand why women compete for a man. Like, congratulations, you're now with an asshole that at least thought about being with another woman. Be as picky with your men as you are with your selfies because there is no delete button for your hoo-ha. And sometimes, honestly, some guys have more dick in their personalities than they do in their pants. Move on, sweetheart. Here's, here's a good one. When you're texting a dude and he seems into the combo, initiating, asking questions, but takes like 25 minutes to respond to you each time and you're like, what the heck, what are these games? Video games, ladies. He's playing video games. And ladies, if you've got a good man, let him know it. 
Make him feel it. Get on his D, not his nerves. And get you, get you a man. A man who wants to invest in you, listen to you, learn from you, see you win, support your visions, and fall in love with you daily because they are out there. I promise you. And ladies, listen. While some girls are out there searching for a rich husband, focus on becoming a rich wife. The most attractive thing about a woman is her hustle. Okay, let me repeat that. The most attractive thing about a woman is her hustle. I hope you're taking notes on this. So cheers to my chicks that are out there getting checks. Respect. And if your man doesn't ask you about the grades you're pulling, how business is going, helping you strategize or motivate you, he ain't for you. Let him go. And don't be a queen waiting on her king. Be a queen busy with her own kingdom until her king arrives. Keep yourself busy, girl. These boys ain't going nowhere. And ladies, if you're with a man, okay, and he doesn't grab your hips and pretend to bang you when you bend over to pick something up, leave his boring ass, sis. Leave his boring ass. And listen, any man, any man can sleep with you, feed you, buy you things, but it takes a real man to help you become a better woman, to build with you, to work with you in building a better life. And if all this man does is lie and delete messages, you're dating Hillary Clinton. And if he only f***s with you when he's in the area, you're dating Wi-Fi. Someone had to say it. And honestly, girls, sometimes you'll just be too much woman. And that's okay. You'll be too smart, too beautiful, too strong, too much of something that makes a man feel like less of a man, which in turn makes you feel like less of a woman. And the biggest, the biggest mistake you can make is removing jewels from your crown to make it lighter for someone else to carry. You don't need that. What you need is a man with bigger hands. I'm literally, you guys can probably see this on camera. I am like full on drip sweating right now. Ooh. Next tip, if your hoo-ha doesn't have a heartbeat when you see him, he ain't the one. And like I said, good men exist. Don't let these bum-ass, trash-ass guys let you think that they don't. And here's the thing, boys literally have zero excuse for not communicating well. Because I've seen them all play group video games and they describe where they're at like it's a life or death situation. So we all know they can communicate perfectly fine. And listen here, a man who wants you will snatch you the F up. Elusiveness is intentional and indecision is a decision. Another tip, it's not real until they show you off on Snapchat because that's where all the hoes are, let's be real. And listen ladies, I don't wanna hear any excuses. Selena Gomez sees her ex-boyfriend on billboards, hears him on the radio, and you complain you see your ex at the grocery store. Move on, honey. Keep it moving. And ladies, this is just a reminder that there are better men out there with an extra inch than the one that is playing games with you. Guaranteed. This is just a reminder that no hoe can steal your man. He made that decision. And ladies, you want to know what will keep a man faithful? I'm about to give you like the golden ticket right here. Himself. It has nothing to do with you. And honey, don't blame a clown for acting like a fool. Ask yourself why you keep going to the circus. Unless he wears a diaper, you can't change him. All right, last tip ladies, I'm gonna leave you with this one. When it becomes more headaches than orgasms, it's not worth it anymore. That is all that I have for today's video. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Like I said, these are some of my favorite videos to make. Um, so if you guys have any suggestions on topics that you want to see me do a tub talk on, leave them in the comment section below and I will see you honeys in the next video. Mwah.